Okay, so problem 10. Calculate the molar concentration of HNO3, nitric acid, in a solution that has a specific gravity of 1.42 and is 70.5%. Weight, okay, W per W. So this means weight of solution, a weight of solute over weight of solution. Okay. So let's start. We are given with specific gravity, specific gravity or relative density. Okay. Density, so we have in the density is equal to M over V. So mass over volume. So having this formula, we know that the units of specific gravity is is 1.42. So we have the units of kilograms per liter. So that's the unit of specific gravity. And also we are given with the weight per weight. Okay, That is weight of the solute per weight of the solution. So that is, since it's weight, so it is in grams. And in this case, it is 70.5%. So, if it's 70.5% in 100% gram, we have 70.5 grams per 100 grams of solution. Okay, so the solute is 70.5 grams and the solution is equal to 100 grams. Okay, so that's percentage. Okay, so given these, given these numbers, we can now solve the concentration of nitric acid okay so let's start with a specific gravity so we have okay, specific gravity okay molar h and o3 is equal to 1.42 kilograms since it's kilograms so i know Per liter, okay, and we have here grams, grams, so we will convert kilograms into liters, into grams rather, so that is in one kilogram, we have 1,000 grams, okay, alright, now we are done with specific gravity, times, Times in a solution, we have 70.5 grams of, an a, of HNO3 per 100 grams. Okay. okay, then let's continue. So let's cancel first. Kilograms, kilograms, grams. grams grams and then we are left with grams of hno3 now we are given here with the atomic mass so we will use that one so 63 63.0 grams per mole we have hno3 and then we are good we are left with mole per liter mole per liter okay. so we have that is 15.89 molar okay yeah so that is the concentration of our nitric acid which is 15.89 molar. Or you applying, I uh, know, applying significant figures, we have 16 molar.
Oh, so we have significant three significant figures. We have 15.9 molar. So 15.9 molar. Okay. So this is our final answer. Okay, that's it.